Welcome back guys, this is Kaimar and today we have a fun video because we're gonna talk about Timo. I know you saw the thumbnail. Yes, if you haven't heard about Timo, they're basically an online marketplace that offer competitive pricing on products on a lot of range of categories and they are just insane. So I started seeing them and then a friend of mine told me about it and I went to check. The part that got me surprised that even things that you find on Amazon, you can also find them on Timo for much cheaper. And I was like, what? So Timo reached out to me and they wanted to partner up to make a video and I said, okay, but let me select my own products because I do want to make this desk set up my own way. So I went to Timo and I started picking up my products. Guys, I was shocked by some of these prices. But anyways, let me show you a couple of stuff that I picked up for this video and then we're going to unbox it together because the package is here. So let's get to the unboxing and start building this desk setup. By the way, for those of you that haven't heard about Timo and haven't downloaded the app yet, download using my link below and you guys can enjoy 50% code. And also for new users, usually when you go into Timo, you're gonna find uh, things for a dollar, like products that cost like $20, $30 for $1. So this thing is insane. So what I did is I pretty much sent what I wanted to the Timo team and some of the stuff was sold out some was not so we kept replacing stuff so at this point this is a mystery box to me so let's see what we got the first thing we're gonna look at right off the box uh oh anyways it's the desk mat all right first thing is a desk mat and ooh, all right so this looks like a very basic desk mat i'm loving the size so far but there's nothing underneath there's no grip there's no pad nothing it's just a piece of leather that they it can bend so i don't even know if this thing is gonna stretch or this i don't know can you see the creases on this look at this I'll do my best to stretch it before putting it on the desk. So far, I like the size. The size was accurate. And let me tell you, this thing was nine bucks. And it was on a 39% discount, which using my link today, you can still get a 50% discount on top of that. All right, next, what we got is a charger. This is supposed to be for, I believe, not only iPhones. So let's see what we got in here. Okay, the look, the quality is not that bad i can still feel some cheap plastic on the bottom but here it's kind of like a felty rubbery feel so this one is a wireless charger and it does also have a watch charger that you can pretty much just place it right here oh and it's kind of magnetic i love that this is where you rest your phone. So like this, you don't have to have any specific phone as long as they have wireless charging. And I think you have also a spot for your AirPods. And it's got two ports. It's got USB-C and USB, I believe this is 3.0 and it comes with its own cords. Yep, this one was $17, crazy. That's a great pick right there. All right, with China, you guys know there's a lot of knockoffs. So I, this one was very, <laughs> I was very impressed when I saw this because everybody knows the king of editing mouses is the Logitech MX. So I found this guy, I could not resist. And he has the body just like the MX. And I was like, I cannot wait to get my hands on this. So yeah, I picked up this mouse. Quality wise and weight still feels cheap, but it kind of got like some nice material going on up here i don't think this button will do much i don't know what the programming of this does kind of clicky i don't know if you guys can hear it's not too bad just a almost like a regular mouse click i don't know how much delay this actually has but we'll test this out so the wheels of course is not as continuous as the ones we know but I was just curious to pick this thing up and I think it does come with its own little dongle which you can also store your little receiver on the bottom and it's battery operated so it takes one battery so I was like man you know with China and these knockoffs I need to try this out guys and this is $17 what and another thing that's so impressive and insane to me is that Timu even though they're still offering these low prices they still have Klarna and Afterpay pay what so some of these things you can snatch up for a dollar and you can still get after pay i'm saying so i thought i would pick up some drawer organizers dude a set like this on amazon it would 
typically cost me, I don't know, I wanna say 30, 50 bucks, something like that. But these things, they are surprisingly pretty good quality for drawer organizers. I like it. And since I use mostly like Ikea drawers, I think they're gonna fit. So we're gonna go through the process and check out that fit together. This is $5 for the freaking set. This is crazy. It feels like robbery. I even forgot these prices because I don't remember what I ordered, okay? I don't, guys. Okay, next, I pick up this little tool to clean my AirPods. And it does come with your little brush and a little scrubber in there. Oh, shoot, sure. oh. This is so you can clean inside when you actually drop your AirPod. Let's see how much you snatch this for, 97 cents. Bang for the buck right there. You know what I call this? Free 99. All right, next, I don't know what's in this box, but it says black single opening. And, oh, that's right. I picked up a laptop holder. Ooh. Ooh, great quality. It looks like it's made out of, um, I don't know if this is steel or aluminum, but I like it already because it does have some rubber inserts. My finger even got caught in there. It does come with a little tool so that you can adjust the bottom if your laptop is wider or slightly narrower. No brand or nothing, which is cool. If you wanna go stealth, you know, you don't want people to know that you picked up this cheap brands with different weird names and this guy we picked up for 18 bucks i take it all right let me just grab this big box that has been staring at me and this is a monitor light by a company called energy they cut off the y because this thing does not use energy it uses power let's check this out because there is no desk setup without a good light bar and wow i'm surprised and i like the length already oh, the mount's got a weight some weight and it's that has grips on these areas i'm guessing this is to grip to your device so it doesn't slide off you slide this thing through here it's pretty dope. So this is supposed to be warm light and daylight. And I'm guessing the controls are on the end because this one doesn't bring any remote or anything. 13 bucks. Just to be clear, if you're a new app user, using my link below, you do get a 50% discount and you might find promotions at a dollar because Timo has promotions going on the entire time and it's just crazy stuff. Okay, what's in this box? No brand. Ah, uh, mystery, drum roll, wow. Oh, this is cool. So you know how I like it to keep green in my office? They actually had this thing that I was, thought it was awesome. Very fragile glass. Some people have been saying I should be using real plants. I know for sure I would kill them, but it's on my desk. Maybe I can take care of them better. Don't fall. Look at that. Whew. Okay, forget I said cheap, fragile glass. This thing is not fragile. And it's got some grommets to keep it safe from sliding exactly what I just did. Gotta go buy plants now to have life plants. Talking about life plants, I bought fake plants. And as I expected, these things are cheap. They are more fragile than real plants. Look, for a video, sometimes you just need some greenery on the background. Like if you can tell, I got my cheap ones right there too, okay? And they're fake and they do the trick. And sometimes from afar, people won't even tell. They won't even know. I might have bought a vase, hopefully I bought a vase for this. All right, next up, another no-name brand. Oh, wait, 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 it's got, this does have a brand. Mamba Snake, I really like it. Comes with a cloth. Timo, look at this packaging. And what do we got here? Oh, snag, okay, that's our wrist rest. So this is an acrylic wrist rest because I saw this thing and I was like, they got these things in clear and it was like gaming-ish. And I'm like, yeah, let's go for it, I want it. Look at this thing. If you have RGBs on your desk, you can actually just plug it here or maybe just put it close to here. And I'm sure this thing will glow but we'll run some tests. All right, $17, and you can actually pick it up for a different size of keyboards. That's what this is for, so you can clean it. And it's got some rubber. It doesn't go anywhere, it doesn't slide all over the place. I don't know how long this video is gonna be. All right, to go with it, the thing that I was most excited to check out, the keyboard. 
by Magigi. These guys typically sell very affordable keyboards. And I was just excited to check this one out. What's a desk setup without a mechanical keyboard? And so far it looks like these are MSA keys and a PBT, maybe looking like double shot. Guys, doesn't sound too bad. I can tell the switches need some lubing, but this one I believe it was red cherry keys. With Timo, you gotta watch out because some mechanical keyboards, they just have some weird switches but this one red switches which is hot swappable so this guy is 21 dollars it's typically 69 and they have a 68 percent on it i did ask for the orange one but apparently they ship everything like this and they just give you your accent colors on the bag so you gotta swap them yourself since these are hot swappable the great thing is that you can always improve on this so maybe we could do a mod in the future because you know how i love orange and it does have your little had adjustments right there and your usb-c port right here so this one is not bluetooth it is wired so you need your cable to connect this all right this besides the keyboard is my favorite thing so since we got a large mat i wanted another mat to kind of offset the desk mat and if you guys don't know already i am a legit sucker for anime Whoo! look at this demon slayer this mat honestly feels way better than that other mat it has the rubbery bottom like i was talking about so the good thing is that that one if it stays in place this one will not slide for sure and it's dope man especially if you like into gaming or anime and last but not least we have a it's a headphone stand look at that if you love wood accents very minimalistic very dope all right guys so this is it for the unboxing so let's put together this desk setup first i need to trash everything on my desk but i'm gonna leave my computer because i don't have a monitor to test and a computer so we are gonna leave my computer everything else has gotta go and we're gonna rebuild it timo style all right guys with the desk clear like i said the only thing i left was my computer so let's start with the desk mat you guys saw it it kind of came pretty banged up. I try to flatten this as much as possible. Okay, here's what I was talking about. See, it's gonna slide because it has no pads, nothing. We bring on the other mat that actually has got a grip. And that's our Demon Slayer. This thing looks legit, I love it. It got the pads, they did good with this guy. And it's got a, I don't know if you guys can tell, it's pretty thick too. We're gonna drop our keyboard, which has nothing to do with the anime theme, but it's a gaming keyboard. We're gonna roll with it. Look at this, backlit, and it works. Next, we're gonna use our X31, the fake MX. You guys know what I'm talking about. So we got the nice receiver. Look at the receiver matching, man. Oh, look, he detected, I guess. Yeah, weird stuff. So it doesn't even have a power button look this i think immediately when you put the battery as long as your dongle is connected you are up you wouldn't expect anything kind of choppy a little bit but it is what it is we got our nice mouse all right this is our charging station of course every setup needs a charging station for your devices all right charging station is live that we're just gonna leave my phone charging i want to see it charges all right, phone is charging. Next thing, my favorite thing on all this setup, especially for your monitor, is your monitor light bar. Okay, there you go. This is your color temperature right here. Bam, 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 halfway, and then full warm light. And let me guess, if you hold it or double tap, it might shut off. Okay, nothing. Okay, so when you hold it, it just turns your brightness down. So double tap. Okay, that's when you turn on and off by your double tap. All right, next we're gonna need, of course, our laptop holder, which I configured it for the iPad instead. So we keep that minimal and we got our minimalist. So we're gonna do that guy right there. And like I said, I did not get any headphones, anything you got around the house, 
just do that it looks freaking cool man i love the wood vibes with the black aesthetics i know here we're going a little bit gaming but i'm loving this and i like also that it keeps the curvature of your headphones that's one thing i look for a lot of my stands are stands that they hold the natural curvature of your headphones because some hung right here and then you start getting creases on your headphones i almost forgot our wrist rest okay so for aesthetics i got this but on the listing it showed with the vase i don't know if i even read that it will not come with the vase so i don't have a vase for it all right next is this planter that i showed you guys so i don't have any real plants apparently you grab these grommets and you slide in and then you slide in your glass and then you're sliding another grommet kind of just to act as a stopper and this would be a nice accent piece just for the core. I might even switch these guys up. I don't know. You can play with it. All right, so now for these organizers, let's see if they fit on the Alex drawers. That is snug. Ah, so you guys can see they don't fit. So if you do end up using these, which I think they still help, they provide some organization. There you go, Timo, man, not bad, like five bucks five bucks man i'm still i'm still shocked by these prices so this is the minimalist desk setup by timo okay guys i'm excited to show you guys this video so i'm gonna shoot to b-roll but as always guys see you guys in the next one peace